Well, one one of the things I love to go on is uh, Hard Stern. Uh, do you think Hard Stern has a wig? Yes. What, why he's do you? Got, he's got some scaffolding up there. Put it that way. <laughs> why do you think he's so afraid to admit it? Because like he's a guy in his sixties with pitch look, black hair. Look, look Yuzi. It took him fucking. It took him like ten years to admit he got a nose job. I called him out on this show. The E guy said. After hiatus, John, look, here's the before picture, here's the after. And they knew it because I, I was the only one with balls enough to go in there. So I went in the studio and go, Howard, what'd you do over hiatus? And he goes, oh, what do you mean, John? I go, what'd you do to your nose? You got yourself a nose job, didn't you, Howie? And then he went, no, I didn't, no, I didn't. Bullshit. It took him 10 years after I left to finally admit he got a nose job. You think he's going to admit to the fucking, the, 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 you know, that fucking, that wig he's wearing, that little fucking skull cap? He's not going to be, you know, he ain't going to admit to that. No fucking way. Like, you think a man who's, a, who's approaching 70 still has black hair? Get the fuck out of here. Uh, well, Gene Simmons does, and he, Gene Simmons would never lie. Oh, yeah. Gene Simmons has the worst wig in rock and roll. Yeah, but, uh, but I like Gene Simmons. Gene was in my video. He's a good guy, but come on, please. But uh, Stern, uh, so he's admitted that he had uh, flings on the set of uh, Private Parts? He's never admitted it, but he's been accused of it. Steve Grillo is pretty certain about it. Yeah, uh, I, I genuinely don't see how anyone alive couldn't go for Jenna Jameson back then? You know, the only thing I'll tell you, PMC, is that um, when I was on the set of Wings, Crystal Bernard, and you can Google this after, she was the hot wand on Wings. She came on to me. She told me to come back to a dressing room, and she came on to me. And I wanted to have sex with them more than anything, but I was married. So I... I said, no. She's like, what's a cute guy like you doing, Mary? And was so coming on to me. And I know I could have banged it, but I, I said no. So maybe Howard could have said no to Jenna Jameson. But who knows? I mean, you know, he could have banged her after, you know, you know, after his separation. I, I think, though, with Jenna Jameson at that time, there's a chance she, she's one of the number one who is of all time. Just... The one of the she looked perfect. She and and we all know she's one of the whoiest fucking who is in who a town that who a. Uh, I I would do her today just so that I could say that I did the same girl from the nineties. I'd do her if she had AIDS. I would do Raquel Welsh today, and she's eighty. Are you kidding me? Yeah, well, I I take a BJ, but I don't know if it. Uh, Go for full, uh, fucking. So, Joan Rivers' corpse is still, but no, I'm not going to make the joke. No, I, can't. I can't make the joke. I'm not going to do it. I, it. It would be too mean. 